Grace, and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is God's Amazing Promise. Abraham is called by God. Let's read. Abraham lived in Haram. Abraham, God said, I want you to leave Haram and go to another land. God didn't tell Abraham where that was. Trust me, God said. God told Abraham to leave. It is hard to leave where they have were living. What's simple? Because like you can think like you don't know also where to go. God didn't tell Abraham where to go. But let's see at the next page that Abraham well listen to God or not disobey. Do this, God said, and your children will be a great nation. How? Abraham wondered. His wife Sarah was too old to have children. Trust me, God said. Oh, we can see at the next time. Why Sarah is always making us so Actually, it said on one page, Sarah is making a soup. God said that Abraham's great nation will be more than like the stars. Question, did God tell Abraham where he was to go? No, God didn't tell Abraham. God, go where I tell you, God said, and you will have more distance than they were the earth stars in the sky. They will bless the whole world. Trust me. So God has promised to Abraham. God kept his promise. And God said there will be more distance than the stars in the sky. You can see. Also now, Sarah is making a suit. Actually, in this story, only except one picture, so Sarah is making a soup. <laughs> Question. Oh, sorry. Golden lamb staff? Okay. So Abraham trusts God. He take everything. He took Sarah, his nephew, and Lot. They own he went there. God told him to go. God went to one. To the land of Canaan. So Abraham trusted God. Sorry, it is young. So uh, actually, he uh, 
substitution and he left. Is a chocolate so young to he has left his umbrella. So he has came now. So Abraham trust God. And they have gone west. Oh, uh, you can see now Sarah is not making a soup. They left house. God said Abraham would have more distance than there are. Number three, the stars. When he arrived, Abraham camped at Shechem. God appeared to him. I will give you this land to you and your children. God said, Abraham built an altar to God there. Abraham has arrived. And Abraham, I think, sacrificed. And God said that God will give this land to you to Abraham and Abraham's children. Well, doesn't even know. Wow, that's a really actually. He only put in a one stone and four stones from somewhere. Abraham traveled around God's promised land. He was glad that he had trust God. So he built an, another altar to give thanks God for all he had been promised. So Abraham looked around and it was so good land. So Abraham built an altar again and now also Sarah is not making a soap here. I didn't know that. Question. Abraham built an altar to God, giving thanks for all he had been promised. True or false? True! Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time I will read another good story. And today I read God's amazing promise. Let's see you next time. Bye!